announcement here. Ladies are probably <laughs> familiar with the self-pampering that comes with visiting a day spa and salon. But for most men, it is a brave new world. And among the bravest is our own Todd Wallace. He's live at the grooming lounge in Northwest that prides itself on being a manly spa. The only question, Todd, is are we ever going to get you out of there? No, I'm <laughs> stuck. I'm staying here. We should also point out this was your story idea, so don't put it all yeah, on me. Yeah, but you're there. Hey, I'm here, man, because I'm the smart one. I got it. Hey, finally, folks, finally a place where men can be treated like the kings, at least we think we are, away from the wise. A place where we have personalized custom men's grooming products. Or how about a nice to my right? Shoe shine. This man can really shine some shoes as well. And as you're awaiting even more services in this luxurious lounge, we're going to be talking to Mike Gilman, who is a co-owner of Grooming Lounge. Mike, good to see you. Come good on to up and talk too. to us, man. Okay, this is a really unique idea. You're taking really a, a spy in some ways and introducing it only to men. How did you come up with this idea? And, and where did you think it would work? Well, the basic concept came about because my business partner and I uh, had a bunch of friends complaining to us that they were sick of going to their wives or girlfriends <laughs> salon or spa and getting these services done. Okay. And so we started talking to each other and said there has to be a way to create a place where guys feel, com feel okay. comfortable, okay. where they can go and get a haircut or a hot lather shave or a manicure and not be intimidated by the women around them. So and that's really what sparked this idea. Men being intimidated by the women around them. That's a new idea. Okay, so, right. so let's, let's talk about your research that went into the products being offered and what you knew would appeal to men. Um, basically, the way we came up with the, both the services and the products was mm -hmm. just by speaking with men and saying, mm -hmm. What are the services that you would like to get, and what are, so, what are some of the services that you desire, but are maybe a little afraid to go get in a female-oriented right. salon? Okay, well, I showed you the shoe shine, some of the grooming products, the nice lounge. Now we're going into the barber area. Tell us about this. Um, this is the barber area. We have six barbers, and in this area you can get everything from an old-fashioned hot lather shave, uh, where we use six Which hot towels. Left. Where okay. we use six hot towels and a freezing cold towel to seal up the pores <laughs> at the end, and you can also get a haircut can get hair coloring. Um, you see this gentleman over here while he's getting a shave is getting a hair in, hand and forearm massage oh, from okay, the that's, lovely that's Aaron. Left. Let's, let's see the hand and forearm massage. Any complaints so far? We have absolutely <laughs> had no complaints. In fact, most guys come in here and say, I've never done this before, and on the way out, they're rebooking appointments rebooking to come back to the grooming lounge. I tell you what, women are smart, and I, I would say smarter than men, because women have known about this stuff for a long time. Men have always been a little reluctant and slow, as we usually are. But, to know what's best for us. This is fantastic, but look folks, that's not all. There's much more. You may have seen earlier in the newscast that I was getting my feet soaked. Come on in. To the right, this is where you would get, I guess in ordinary shops, a, a, a pedicure. But no, here it's called a foot treatment. It's Describe a foot, the difference for me. Uh, the foot treatment is that our foot treatment is specifically designed for guys who are on their feet all day or uh -huh. wear uncomfortable shoes just because uh -huh. they look nice with their suit. So <laughs> okay. if you're a waiter or a bartender or just a guy who's walking a lot, you plop your feet in this jacuzzi bath here, you get your feet rubbed a little, and uh, you're ready to go again. Okay, and then to our left, a gentleman here receiving a nice manicure. And we call those a business manicure. Now, what's a business manicure? Well, a business manicure is called such because uh, your hands are very important in business. You know, okay, sure. That's the first thing you offer a prospective client or mm -hmm. maybe even a prospective wife or girlfriend. Mm -hmm. So your hands need to be in good shape. Is there a difference between a business manicure and a regular manicure? Absolutely. This is, is tailored to a man. Um, so there's no polish um, mm -hmm. like women might get. Mm -hmm. And there's also several steps we throw in, um, including hot towels and a deep uh, hand and forearm massage that are just oh. things that guys have requested and that they're okay. very interested in. No polish unless you get the clear polish, but that's another story. All right, and then there's also a massage that you can receive. Sure. Well. Tell us about that. Um, well, we have a couple different rooms in here. You'll see there's no one in here right now, but this is a that's massage right. room. Okay. And uh, a lot of men after a tough day or a lot of guys who work out like to mm -hmm. come in and get a rub down. Okay, I'm sold. 1745 L Street. Yep. You also have a web website, too, ground, uh, groomlounge.com. Right, uh, www.groomingloungecom where we sell all the products that uh, we sell here in the store, and people can also buy gift certificates. Okay. Mike Gilman, you got a problem because I'm stuck. I know. I want you back. We're joined at the hip. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank I you. appreciate it. This is unbelievable. Fellas, it's got two thumbs up, a great endorsement from me. Yes. Michael, ba I know you're coming down later today yes. or sometime soon. Back to you. Todd, Michael. we usually don't put our arm around the people we interview on the news, but that's okay. <laughs> but it's that kind of place, male bonding. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> that's what it is. All right. Thank you very much.